Hey there! Today's topic, the spiritual principle of courage. This is the courage in a man to bear unflinchingly what heaven sends. Euripides. We men have learned to associate courage with excelling on the field of battle, being heroic, fighting against the odds, overcoming an enemy by strength and cunning. Manly courage in our culture, in our myths, movies, and music, has largely dealt with outwardly heroic acts. Although this kind of courage is real and not to be discounted, there are other forms of courage essential to the spiritual life. Looking inward to discover our faults and fears requires a different kind of courage. It is a brave man who can take a hard look at his life and see where he has harmed himself and others. It is not easy to place our own behaviors and our own choices under the microscope, but often, once we search through the past, we're simply reminded that we're human. We have made mistakes, and some of our choices may have been harmful. None of us enjoys admitting past mistakes and examining the motives behind them, but we have to do it if we're going to stop repeating the past. To heal the pain we've caused ourselves and others, we have to look at our lives squarely, unflinchingly. Today I will use my courage to review my past. Today I will use my courage to review my past. Courage. Never realized how important courage was until I started doing the same things for me. It kind of freed me up to do and be who I really want to be. Let's prepare for meditation. Take a comfortable seat. Make sure the base of your spine and the crown of your head are extending upward and outward. Inhale, let. Exhale, go. Gently close your eyes. And inhale, let. And exhale, go. And we will begin our one minute meditation on courage, the courage to change. Take a deep breath in and exhale, peace. Take another deep breath in and exhale, peace. Gently open your eyes and relax your shoulders. And think about the courage that it takes for each and every one of us to move through our days, to be present for one another. Have a wonderful day, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Peace.